Hey guys and welcome to today's video. So in today's video I'm going to be reviewing a company called Hot Miami Styles. They're an online fashion company which do everything from like clubbing to swimwear to basics. They just do like the general whole shebang. I've heard really good things about the quality of their items and thought I really need to give it a go because their items look insane. So I got quite a few items which is why this video is split into two parts because when I received the items I realised I had literally ordered half sequin stuff, half bandage dresses, so it just made sense instead of having one super long video I'll review the sequin stuff and the bandage stuff, so that's what I'm going to do I did get two things which fit into neither of those categories but I'm going to throw them in at the end of this video just so you guys can see them, they're still really nice but they're well you'll find out what they are but um, yeah that being said this is the sequin video and I'll get right to it so the first item I got is this mermaid cutout dress and it is absolutely insane. Look at those sequin colours. Like, it's literally iridescent. I'm just in love with it. It is long sleeved, and normally I'm a bit iffy with long sleeved because I can feel really restricted in them. But because I, when I read the like material, it's meant to be very stretchy. So I was like, okay, I'll risk it. I'm like in love with this dress. And it is very stretchy. Like, for the fact it's covered in sequins, I am surprised. I thought it'd be quite a sturdy dress, but like, when I say sturdy, like quite a non stretchy dress. But no, it's stretchy and covered in sequins. It's a very thick material, so it will be quite warm. And the only thing I am worried about is the length of this dress. On the model it looked rather short, but I fell in love with the style. I had to just try it. Um, so we'll see when I try it on, but it's a bit like, eh, please fit. Um, it does have a sort of like keyhole peephole in the front, which is perfect because with dresses that come up to your neck, especially sequin ones or embroidered ones, they can like be quite you know, flattening effect, if that makes sense. So the fact it's got a peephole will just be ideal and show off my curves. And then it does have a sort of like choker thing at the top to join it all together. I'm just, oh, I can't get over the color of these sequins. Like in any sort of disco light, I'm literally gonna be like sparkling. Ah, oh, so excited. Um, and then it does come with spare sequins, just in case you catch it or have a wardrobe malfunction, I guess, and just need to like fix it up and make it look perfect again. But no, I absolutely love this. So this is how it fits, and the length is just about perfect, I'd say. It definitely couldn't be any shorter, otherwise I definitely would be like not comfortable wearing it. But um, no, it's, it's just perfect, so I'm really happy about that. The long sleeves are really nice because it means I'm not going to get any rubbing on my underarms due to the sequins. It's just all sequins, so that works really well. And the peephole, as I said before, just I think it just shows off the curves really nicely. So really like this one. I think it's going to be a proper showstopper in the club. Or just like going out. I think I might wear it with black tights just to ensure, you know, just to make sure it stays where it is and just... I think I'd be a bit more comfortable with tights on, but um, no, really like this one. Now, the next dress I got is a nude off the shoulder mesh sort of dress. It's absolutely gorgeous, covered in silver sequins. Again, long sleeved. I don't know, I'm just in a long sleeve mood when I must have been ordering all this stuff. But because it's off the shoulder, it, sh it shouldn't be restrictive. This one is less stretchy, and because of that, I sized up. I got a medium in this dress and a small in the last dress. Um, but it does, it's off the shoulder and it has like the sticky rib stuff at the top to like make sure it stays up and doesn't fall down whilst you're clubbing, which is perfect. It does look a little bit big, but um, I think it will still fit because whenever I think something looks big, I try it on and it's like, oh, it fits. But <laughs> we'll see when I try it on. It does have a bit of stretch, so I feel as though I could have gone for a size small, but I just didn't want to risk it. It's such a gorgeous dress and I, I wanted to make sure I could get it on. But um, yeah, and it's just got like nude mesh in between all the silver sequins. Absolutely gorgeous. So with this one, it's a little bit big, but I think it still looks nice. But I definitely could have done with a small with this one. But I absolutely love the length of it. Like just above my knees, the perfect length of a dress in my opinion. But round my waist, I've just got a little too much material. But I could get it tailored in at my waist because then it's like, it's a pretty show-stopping dress. But... Now, I should have gone for a small, but absolutely, oh, it's just gorgeous. I feel like a little disco ball. But, um, yeah, so, I, I, it's still wearable. I still could wear this out, I think. Um, just wish I, just wish I sized down a little bit so it doesn't, like, hollow back too much. So this would be, like, less material there. But, um, nonetheless, it's definitely wearable and I still love it. So, the quality of it is absolutely gorgeous, though. Like, look at it. 
Now the next dress I got, I also got in a medium and it's this black sequin fringe dress. So the top half is all gorgeous like just sequin sort of floral effect and then down the bottom is the Charleston frill everywhere so when I'm dancing around like that's gonna be so cool because it's sort of more subtle like I have a costume which I love like I would love to wear as a dress which is covered in frills head to toe and um, it's just a bit too much to go clubbing in because it literally looks like I'm dressing up as a 1940s character but um, no this just being at the bottom it's subtle but it's perfect and at the top of the frills it's sort of like woven I don't know if you, yeah how cool is that? Absolutely gorgeous. So I got this in a medium just because, again, I wasn't sure on the amount of stretch in it. But there is a bit of stretch, so probably could have gone with a small, but a medium doesn't look too huge. It will probably fit quite nice. Um, but yeah, really like this one. So this is how this one fits, and a medium fits absolutely fine. Um, I have a feeling a small would have like fitted as well, but I mean, the medium looks fine, so I'm happy. Um, love the skirt. It's going to be great to dancing it's just got a really cool effect on her skin and um, the back is slightly low i'd say like it comes sort of like my bra wants to sit about an inch higher but i just pull it lower or if you're worried just use the low back converter which is featured in my bra hacks video which i made a few weeks ago but um no i really love it and i love the top of it like i love the fact it's half sequins and then half frills so it's not too like the frills can be quite intense, I think, and I don't think this looks like a costume at all, so let me know what you think, but I think this one looks really cool. I like it. And also the fact, like, I think a small would have fit me, but a medium also fits me fine, so I'm quite happy with getting a medium, because it just means there's nothing that's too tight on me, so it's a really nice dress to move in, so I'm glad I went with a medium. So the next thing I got isn't sequiny at all, but it's this ribbed off-the-shoulder uneven hem dress. And it just looks like this. I got it because I really liked the colour. I wanted like a nice little burgundy jumper dress. And again, long sleeved. <laughs> but um, yeah, the bottom of it just has this sort of like crisscross. But that like, like where it goes higher, it's on my leg, not the middle of my leg. So it works well. It's just quite a cute little extra to wear with tights, I'd say. Just, you know, I think it'd be a really cute thing for sort of winter. I just really liked it. Um, I got this in the small and it's very stretchy. It's just ribbed. Um, just a really nice material really so so this is how it fits and it's absolutely gorgeous it fits absolutely perfectly and um, no I really like this it reminds me of something my mum would wear my mum loves the off-the-shoulder sort of jumper dresses and um, no it's just gorgeous it's really comfy to wear and so stretchy and I really like the detailing at the bottom like I, when I first got it I wasn't sure if it was needed because I was like oh I would you know it might as well just be straight at the bottom but no I think it actually adds it's quite a nice little addition so really like this one I just love the neckline I think it's so elegant and just no with tights and boots it'll look perfect for winter I think really like this and then to finish it all off I just got myself this black lace-up crop top um, just because I thought it was just a really elegant design um, it's just a high neck sort of top in a really soft material like I don't think you're going to be able to tell, but it's like, it feels like it's lycra, but it's not. It's cotton. It's so nice. And then the lace-up just goes down the sleeve. If I can, well, I will try on in a second and then you'll see it. If I can get my arm in it. Just like that. So it just goes down your arm in like crisscrosses. That makes it look weird. It's really pretty, basically. But um, now I'll go pop that on. And then finally, this is how the crop top fits. And as you can see, the arms are just this really unusual lace-up sort of crisscross. They need to, you need to like adjust them when they're on. Like right now, a few triangles or diamonds are a bit too tight. So I just need to adjust how much string goes through what just to make it a bit looser. But the actual top is a really cute crop top and fits really nicely. So um, no, I really like this top. I think it will look lovely with high-waisted black jeans or blue jeans. I just really like it. So that's all I've got for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe and give it a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments. I'll link all the links to the items in the description box and all the links to my social media. If you'd like to support me, I do have a Patreon or if you'd like to follow my other social media. I do have Twitter, but I never really use it. Um, I've just never got into it. I just, <laughs> I am trying, but I have one if you want to follow it. And I have an Instagram, which I post regularly on. So yeah, that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.